Thank you, Mr. Deputy Speaker. Man is fallen. Some people in every society, in every system, will give in to temptation. Corruption is, if you like, not a, a product of politics, it's the, the normal state of affairs. The amazing thing is that in Western democratic societies we've found ways to constrain it and to incentivize people, not just systematically, to loot the state. But one thing we know is that you diminish the capacity for corruption when you take decisions closely, uh, as closely as possible to the people that they affect. And this is the fundamental problem with our structures here and in Brussels. It's not that the European Union attracts bad people, of course it attracts some bad people like everyone else. It's that there is such a distance between people and decision makers. There's such a uh, tenuous link between taxation, representation and expenditure that the system encourages at best negligent spending and at worst straightforward graft. The solution, of course, is to push powers downwards and outwards to national or local authorities or better yet, to individual citizens.